Good evening, everyone. Tonight, we're talking to you from one of the special venues in European football, the San Siro, here in the city of Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And on the menu, action from Europe's premier club competition, the Champions League. This, the first leg of the semi-final. It's Inter facing Milan. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. The Inter starting lineup. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Romelu Lukaku. The Milan team, Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. And underway now in this Champions League semi final first leg. Diaz, Benasser, Giroud, and a goal! The opening statement of this semi-final, how important can that prove to be? Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Well, then to restart the game, it's going to be interesting to see how they reply to that setback. Henrik Mkhitaryan. The ball with Martinez. Chalhanolu. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? He's protecting it effectively. Danmian for attacking possibilities. That's a nice looking ball. Not quite the cross he was hoping for. Pressing as a team. A very effective challenge put in. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Well, the supporters think it's on. No way through. Varela. Spot on with that tackle. Rade Krunic. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Ben Asser. Krunic. Diaz. 
It's with Diaz. Giroud. Benasser. And back with Giroud. It should be! Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Giroud. Diaz. Krunic. Superb block. Barella. Damian. Giving the ball away. Chalanolu. Hendrik Mikitarian. The ball with Martinez. Now, what can they do from here? Barella on to Lukaku. Malik smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Diaz. Can he take the chance? And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Dumfries. They've regained possession. Leal. And Giroud waits to fire. And the problem not completely solved. And fine goalkeeping. They take it short. Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. Now, how about the short corner? Oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. And the flag has gone up just when he looked ready to pounce, perhaps. Well, he was just too static in the end, which is a shame because that was a dangerous situation. <laughs> Benasser. Tonali with it. Calabria. Cross blocked. Benasser. Calabria. Very quick thinking there. Damian. Leao, Krunic, and that will be a corner. <laughs> Let's see about the delivery. Not the best clearance. 
Grunic. It's got to be! And it goes! A three-goal cushion! And you truly sense it's a matter of how many! Well, here we can see it again. It's a lovely ball in behind, perfectly timed. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Three goals without reply. Mkhitaryan. Well, that is how to play advantage. And just losing control of the ball, and it will be a throw-in. Well, he let them go on, but now he's going to deal with the yellow card situation. Yeah, and he was always going to be booked for that challenge. It was a poor one, you have to say. Chalanoru. Mkhitaryan. On to Martinez. Well, the keeper committed himself. In a short corner, let's see. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Martinez on to Lukaku putting his body on the line and the ball's been given away by Lukaku Benassa there to take it away well the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick well just a warning on this occasion might have decided to hand out the yellow card Marco Martinez and with that the attack fizzles out Olivier Giroud on the ball Rafael Leal and Milan will get the throw in Teo Hernandez Benassa Giroud he's in with a chance majestic piece of goalkeeping well he loves the big moments doesn't he and he's proved it again there great goalkeeping Delivering it. Well, it has come to nothing. Tremendous block. Robbed of possession. Nikki Tarian. Lukaku. Romelu Lukaku now. A danger here as he runs at them. Martinez now Mkhitaryan Chalhanolu and back with Lukaku wasted possession again Chalhanolu 
Oh, he's lost possession. He'll have a go here. Well, in actual fact, it ended up being a simple claim for the keeper. Martinez. Teammates available. The supporters want to see him have a go. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Diaz. It's with Giroud. Can he finish this? Hernandez. Benasser. Now Giroud. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Martinez. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Martinez. And intercepted it. Dumfries. Martinez on a pass that lacks quality. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. Can he make it count? Oh, that's a fine save. Who can he pick out? Outrageously good piece of defending on the line. Krunic. Diaz. Leao. Delivering it into the box. Well, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Chalanolu. And he takes it away. And teammates around him. Lukaku. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. And he read it well, intercepting it. Olivier Giroud. Well, he could really get at the opposition. And let's give credit to the defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Krunic. Can they convert? Leao. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. But he's also showing him the yellow card. Yeah, he had to make the challenge, but it was always going to be risky, and so it proved. Is it going to be 4-0? And slots it home! Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Lukaku. It's with Chalanolu. Martinez. Perfectly positioned to take it away.
Lukaku. And taking it away. Radek Krunic. And it's a quality pass. That's all they can conjure for now. Already closing him down here. Miki Karian. Romelu Lukaku now. Martinez. Miki Karian. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. In position. Terrific block there. Fancy a short one. Mickey Tarian with the cross. Well, far from the ideal header, and the goalkeeper had it all the way. Ficayo Tomori. Olivier Giroud. It's with Diaz. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Alessandro Bastoni Hendrik Mkhitaryan Barella has it Dumfries Lukaku Martinez Lukaku on to Barella take it away breaking at pace do they have the guile to open up, up the defence? But they dealt with the threat posed. Martinez. Di Marco. The ball with Martinez. Lukaku. Oh, off the post. Still alive. And problem solved for now. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. Olivier Giroud. Leal. And Giroud now at the controls. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Dumfries. Lukaku. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Martinez. Now with Barella. Mkhitaryan. And a goal! He's put it away! A celebratory moment! Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Rade Krunic trying to really get at the opposition here Calabria now with Giroud Leal nice looking pass The defender doing his job. Mkhitaryan. Well, closed down straight away. Rafael Leao. 
Olivier Giroud. On the ball, Rafael Leal. Mkhitaryan. Barella has it. Dumfries. Mkhitaryan. Now with Lukaku. And the ball's been given away by Lukaku. Leal. A really sumptuous ball. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Barella. And it's with Dumfries. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Dumfries. And plenty of space for this inter attack. Chalanolu. Martinez. And hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Martinez. Now with Chananolu. Return to Martinez. Lukaku. Opportunity. Matteo Damian. And in. Oh, yes. Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They delivered the goal. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Calabria, Benassa, Rade Krunic, and he read it well, intercepting it. Rafael Leao, Giroud, and getting across to stop it. Now the delivery, and the keeper throws himself up the ball. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at the San Siro. And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he scored a very tidy goal, but his movement and ability to create chances has been superb today. He's been a constant threat to these defenders. Benasser. Giroud. And a goal! The opening statement in this semi final. How important can that prove to me? Diaz. And there is the goal! He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Got to be. 
second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Mkhitaryan on to Lukaku. Firing it in. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. A really effective shielding under pressure. Ben Asser. Good visualisation and execution. Krunic. Calabria. Really good block. Good pressure high up the pitch. Using his physical strength to shield it. Chalanolu. The ball with Martinez. Federico Di Marco. Now moving the ball impressively here. Martinez. It's with Chalanolu. Excellent defending. Rafael Leao. Ben Asser. Given away by the Rossoneri. And teammates around him. Mkhitaryan. And he's in. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Well, you can sense a goal coming here, and so can these Inter fans. This is so much better. Oh, another one for them! And with plenty of time still remaining, this game is very much back on! Well, look at the replay here, because they don't come much better than this. He hits it so sweetly. What a goal this is. Underway and hope for Inter. Can they come up with another one? Olivier Giroud. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, the referee has decided to book him. Well, it's not a good challenge, and quite rightly, he gets a yellow card for that. Krunic, Hernandez, fantastic work to thwart the danger, and a super header, it looked as though it might be going in, and it's gone behind for the corner. Who can he pick out? And the goalkeeper really exuding confidence. They have to take it away. And Milan looking dangerous. In position here to protect the ball. Hernandez. On to Giroud. Determined defending. Chalanolu. Can they hit on the break? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Brahim. Rade Krunic.
Lukaku. Lukaku. On to Barella. Surely the equaliser. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Doing well to keep possession. Can he play it in? Strength and control, a big part of his game. Teo Hernandez. Sandro Tonali. Milan moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Hernandez. Now Giroud. Can he finish? Big chance. Terrific block there. Diaz. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Being pressed hard. Martinez. Fluency of movement. That's really good and effective physical play. Sandro Tonali. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Olivier Giroud. Teo Hernandez. Rade Krunic. And an astute piece of defending. Matteo Damian. Good pressure high up the pitch. But he took care of it defensively. Keeping possession of the... And in with a real chance. And a goal! Cause for celebrations again. Two in front. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Not a scoreline we see all that often. 5-3. 30 minutes to go then. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Well, no card, but I think he can consider himself suitably warned. Italian. Very quick thinking there. Barella. Long way out this. Making sure it didn't get past him. Sandro Tonali. Diaz Krunic moving the ball nicely looking for that final pass and just like that they don't have the ball anymore a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it Well, it is a caution, and quite frankly, he can't really quibble. No, it's been coming, hasn't it? He's got to be careful now. He could get a red if he's not careful.
Hendrik Mkhitaryan. Martinez using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Well, that's the end of that move for now. And room now out on the flank. Sandro Tonali. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. And clears the danger. Giroud. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Oh, a nice looking pass. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. A foul, but advantage played. And support available. Krunic. Benasser. On to Giroud. Tonali with it. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And as a play it goes, throw-in coming up here. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Oh, but they've lost it now. Mkhitaryan. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Lukaku. Now with Martinez. Back to Chalhanolu. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Well, shielding the ball admirably. And using his strength to shield the ball. Henrik Mkhitaryan. Varela has it. Mkhitaryan. Lukaku. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. Could pull one back here. And he does! He's thrown his team a lifeline. The belief is back. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. And I must say, I've had to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Now, Milan could be onto something. Martinez. Well read to win possession back. Olivier Giroud. Now, let's see what they can do here. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. 20 minutes to go in this one. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Can they square the game? And the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch-side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Oh, that's a real concern, looks from the bench, I have to tell you, because he's landed right on top of his elbow, and that's causing him some serious pain at the moment. Cheers, Jeff. Rade Krunic, using his strength to shield the ball. And a creative look about this, doing well to keep possession. And a very good challenge. Giroud. Breaking at pace. Now he must favour the cross. Well, not a great ball played in.
Well, very effective play in possession. Well, he's almost been hassled out of play here. Rade Krunic. And very deftly cut out. An alert piece of defending. Lukaku. Oh, a goal! The equaliser! They've completely changed the equation! Well, as the replay shows us, this is the way to beat tight market. Just look how he turns with the ball. That's a fantastic goal, you have to say. level again here both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle and taking it away really doing a fine job of protecting the ball well that's a foul and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position and a yellow card it's going to be Stuart yeah the ref got that right it's a yellow card all day long Has eyes for goal from a long way out and how close it was. Well, when you can strike a ball like that, it's always worth a try. Barella and using his strength to shield the ball. Martinez well, moving the ball impressively here Martinez might really be able to trouble them here well didn't go as a plan in the end Alexis Salamakers on the ball Rafael Leal the Rossoneri pushing forward with options available Oh, he's given the ball away. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Lukaku. Into the advanced position. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Smuggled away. Charanoru. Well, strong play here. Well, decent effort, but not troubling the keeper too much. He's using his strength to good effect. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Olivier Giroud. Brunic in position. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Can they hit on the break? There to take it away. Giroud. He continues his run. Out of play then for a Milan throw. Well, they've decided to make a change. Calabria and strong play here Giroud must take the lead here and a goal 
late derby drama as Milan take the lead. Well, here it is again. The cross is inch perfect, just begging somebody to run onto it. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Lukaku. Time and the scoreline against Inter, but they're not out of this. Oh, is he going to be punished here? Well, it really wasn't a great effort, was it? And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. It needs an accurate cross. Must be! Well, at this stage of the game, you have to be more ruthless. Well, that just might be their last chance. What a miss that is. And the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident. A yellow card it's going to be. Well, what an atmosphere inside the San Siro. But can Inter find a moment of inspiration to get themselves back into this game? Time's not on their side. Well, still pressing for a goal here. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Rade Krunic. Shielding the ball superbly. De Kate Delare. Tremendous ball played through. Well, he makes the save, and a good thing, too. Well, what a save it is. But can they now go and get that equaliser? And he's fired over the corner. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Dumfries. It's with a Cherby. Mickey Tarian. Francesco a Cherby. Barella. The ball with Martinez. Enter fighting against the clock and the scoreline, but still they believe. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. <laughs> Lukaku. He's protecting it well. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. De Kate Delare. Giroud, Krunic, and well, he stopped them in their tracks. Martinez. Will he play it in? And using his strength to shield the ball. Still looking for space. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Looked like an effective counter-attack, but brilliantly red. Well, the Inter fans are really getting behind their team here, but will it be enough? What a finish we're going to get to this game. Lukaku, an alert intervention. Being egged on by the crowd. Chalhanolu. No way through. Good physical play. Martinez, just the challenge that was required.
Charles de Ketelare. Leao. Can he finish them off? Teo Hernandez. Benacer. Now with Giroud. Calabria. And it's with Dumfries. Barella. Romelu Lukaku now. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? What a shocking pass, really. Olivier Giroud. On the ball, Salamakers. Well, not hard to read that pass. Gozens. Chalanolu. Before will they go, chasing the game. Martinez. Firing it towards goal. Pressing high to win the ball. Full time. And at the end of this first leg, it's Milan with the advantage. Well, at this stage of the tournament, you'd take any lead going into that second leg. I tell you what, though, this tie is far from over. Very little to split between the two sides, and it's set up perfectly for round two. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.